Katie Loves the Kittens by John Himmelman. Today was the most exciting day in Katie's whole life. Sarah Ann brought home three little kittens. Katie loved those kittens so much. As soon as she saw them, she howled, Aroo! Aroo! She always howled like that when she was very happy. But Katie's howling frightened the little kittens. They ran in all directions. Katie chased them throughout the house. Aroo! Aroo! She howled. No, 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 Katie, said Sarah Ann. You are scaring the kittens. You stay away from them until they get used to you. Sad. She did not want to scare the kittens. Later that day, Sarah Ann was playing with her new pets. Katie watched from around the corner. She wanted to play with the kittens, too. She just loved them so much. She tried to control herself. She tried and tried and tried, but she couldn't stop herself any longer. She burst in the room. The kitten scattered. Aroo! Aroo! She howled as she chased them around the room. No, Katie, no, said Sarah Ann. You scared them again. Katie felt sadder than before. Poor little kittens, she thought. That night, the kitten slept with Sarah Ann in her bed. Katie missed them already. Katie went out through the kitchen door. She looked up at Sarah Ann's window. That's where the kittens are, she thought. She climbed up the bushes and looked in the window. The kittens were fast asleep. Oh, what sweet little kittens, she thought. I would love to smell them. She sniffed as hard as she could, but they were too far away. She climbed quietly on the windsill. She quietly slid under the window and leapt on the bed. The kittens went flying in the air. Kitty was so excited. Aroo! Aroo! She howled. Sarah Ann picked up the dog. Katie, what am I going to do with you? Don't you like the kittens? Katie felt very, very sad. In the morning, Katie walked in the kitchen. Three bowls of food waited for her. She ate the first bowl. Mmm, she thought, this is good. She ate the second bowl. Yum, yum, yum. She thought, when she was halfway through the last bowl, Sarah Ann walked in. Oh, Katie, you ate the kitten's food, she said. Oh, no, thought Katie. Now she felt sadder than ever. She went to her bed and lay down. I love those kittens so much, she thought. All I do is scare them and eat their food. Katie stayed in her bed all day. After a while, she fell asleep. When she woke up, she was not alone. The kittens had fallen asleep on top of her. Katie was so excited, she wanted to howl. She wanted to jump. She wanted to chase them all over the room and run around in circles and play with them. But she didn't. That's my good little Katie, said Sarah Ann. The end.